What is up everybody, Garden State Aviation here, back with another video. This is the Newark Liberty International Airport update for the month of April 2021. Now this is actually pretty exciting as I have finished my airport board as you guys will see throughout the video. So yeah, that being said, let's commence the airport update. Starting off this airport update, we have the United Boeing 77-10 Dreamliner. This is in the Continental slash Old Livery. He just came in from Frankfurt this morning, and later today he'll be heading out to Los Angeles LAX. Now, um, I don't have any GSC, as you guys have seen uh, throughout all of these airport updates uh, so far. I don't have any GSC. I do plan on getting some this year. Even if it's just a few parcel loaders or something like that, it's still a GSC. But uh, yeah, I don't have any more. Uh, I don't really have any GSC, uh, but I do plan to get some in the future. So um, you guys should look forward to that in the future. But yeah. Moving on down the line, we have this United Airbus A319. This is in the new slash blue evolution livery he just came in from montrose airport in colorado i th i think it's in colorado i don't know but uh, yeah he just came in from montrose uh and later today he'll be heading out to houston george bush intercontinental airport here at gate s7 or sierra 7 we have the spirit airbus at 20 neo is in the bananas livery he came in from fort myers uh and this evening he'll be loading up for a flight out to Fort Lauderdale. Now, um, Spirit actually, despite what many people think, they don't just fly the AT-21s and their AT-20s in New York. They also fly the Airbus AT-20 Neo. Now, uh, I actually looked on flight number 24 earlier today uh, before from the soap update, and this is actually accurate as uh, today they came in from Fort Myers and later today they're sending one of their AT-20 Neos out from here in Newark to Fort Lauderdale. But yeah. Moving on down the line, we have this United Boeing 777-300ER. This is in the Blue Evolution slash New Livery. He came in from New Delhi this morning, and later today, he'll be heading out to Frankfurt. Here at gate S4 or Sierra 4, we have this Scandinavian Airlines SAS A330-300. He came in from Copenhagen this morning, and this afternoon, he'll be heading out to Copenhagen. Here at gate S10 or Sierra 10, we have this United Express Embraer ERJ-175. This is in the Continental slash Old Livery. He just came in from Charleston, and later this evening, he'll be heading out to Jacksonville, Florida. Here we have this United Boeing 787-10 Dreamliner. This is in the Blue Evolution slash New Livery. He came in from London Heathrow, and he pulled into stands on another part of the airport. And now he's waiting here for the Delta 737-800 to come onto the taxiway. And right now he's waiting to continue on his taxi out for his flight to Rome Fiumicino Airport. On um, part of the United Boeing 787-10 Dream Hour and the Blue Evolution Slash Delivery, we have this Delta Boeing 737-800. This is in the normal livery. Uh, he came in from Atlanta earlier today, and right now he's taxiing onto the taxiway to uh, his flight out to Salt Lake City. Here we have an Air India Boeing 787-8 Dream Hour. This is in the Mahatma Gandhi livery. He's just waiting for this cargo jet Boeing 767-300F to push back. Uh, and then once he pushes back and taxis out uh, the uh, Air India 787-8 Dream Hour in the Mahatma Gandhi livery, he'll be heading out to Mumbai. And previously, he came in from Mumbai. Here at gate S12 or Sierra 12, we have this United Boeing 77-9 Dream Hour. This is in the Blue Evolution slash New Livery. He just came in from Tokyo, Haneda, and tomorrow morning he'll be heading out for his flight out to Sao Paulo in Brazil. Here on the taxiways next to the regional stands, we have two aircraft. Starting off here, we have this United Boeing 737-800 is in the Blue Evolution slash New Livery. He pushed back out of gate S28 or CR28, which is right uh, over there. And uh, he came in from San Diego, and right now he's pushing, uh, not pushing, uh, he's on the taxiway taxiing uh, for a flight out to Orangestad. And next to him, just waiting for the United to pull out of the regional stand area, the regional slash mainland stand area. We have the Spirit 8021-200 uh, in the Bananas livery. He just pulled up from the runway from his flight from Fort Lauderdale, and he'll be heading to the same gate that the United 737 came out of, which is uh, S28 or CR28, which is right there. Uh, and later today, he'll be heading out to Orlando. 
Here we have a trio of aircraft at the mainline stands, uh, but starting off on the bottom of this trio, we have the Spirit A321-200. This is in the banana delivery. He came in from a ferry flight from Atlantic City. He was covering for a Spirit AT20 that needed to go into maintenance here in Newark. Uh, so he covered him and he flew up from Atlantic City. And right now he's chilling at gate S19 or CR19. And later today, he'll be subbing for the AT2200 for a flight out to Las Vegas. Continuing on with this trio of aircraft next to the Spirit AT21 to Orange and the Bananas Library, we have this Alaska Awning Those Who Serve 737 uh, He's chilling at gate S17 or CR17. He came in from San Francisco earlier today, and later today he'll be heading out to Shipmouth International Airport, otherwise known as Aviation 060 Airport. And the last of the trio of aircraft on this side of the mainline slash regional stands, we have this United Star Alliance Boeing 737-800. He just pulled in to gate S13 or Sierra 13 after coming in from Miami. And later today, he'll be heading out to Nassau in the Bahamas. Moving on to the other part of the mainline slash regional stands, we have this United 757-200. This is in the Her Art here in New York, New Jersey livery. He just came in from Denver and later today, he'll be heading out to Orlando MCO. And next to him, we have this United 737-800. This is in the Blue Evolution slash New Livery. Earlier today, he came in from San Jose, and right now he's loading up passengers for his flight out to Montego Bay. Just pushing out of cargo stand C3 or Charlie 3, we have this cargo jet Boeing 767-300F. He's pushing out for his flight out to Bermuda, and a few days ago, he came in from Hamilton John C. Monroe Airport in Ontario. Okay, so now that the airport update part of the video is done, uh, I just want to show you guys the full, completed version of my model airport. Now, of course, I still need some modeling grass. I know it's been like four months now or something, two months, three months, whatever it is. Uh, I still need some more modeling glue, but um, I'm going to get that sometime in April, so this April, so yeah. Uh, the mod Basically, my model airport is almost complete, I, as you guys saw. For the update, I added the taxiway stop lines, um, I added uh, more stands, and I added the cargo stands. Now you might be like, you might be asking, why didn't you just make the stands like this? Well, because I thought like, you know, give extra room. So not, so not only do you have the aircraft, but you also have extra loading space for the cargo. But uh, yeah, that was uh, the quick airport update. Uh, and that was the quick airport board tour of my full completed board. And now let's get to the outro. That being said, that does conclude this video. If you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, turn the notification bell so you my videos. And comment down below what do you think about the airport update and what do you think about my uh, model airport. But yeah, once again, thank you for watching today's video and I'll see you in the next video. As always, goodbye.